Hello there, everybody. This is gonna be your, uh, this is, or hello there, Libra, Libra Rising. This is gonna be your October love reading for the month of October. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna cut these cards, we're gonna put them into quarters. We're gonna do two for the first quarter, two for the second quarter, two for the third quarter, two for the fourth quarter, and we're gonna see exactly what wants to go on in terms of your month and in terms of everything moving forward. So go ahead and just start cutting these cards here and just see exactly what wants to come out here for you. Let's Let's see if there's any cards here. We have one card right here. And we have two cards here. Okay. And we're going to just keep on going out here. Ooh. Well, there's some cards as well wanting to come out. Yep, we've got this card and this card. And we're going to go ahead and just see exactly what other card wants to flop out here. Let's see. For the last one. I'm pretty excited. Let's see. Uh, oh. Well, there's two cards. So we might we might actually go into that card. Who knows? So, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and just start out by by going on this card. The first card here is a two of swords in reverse, saying, honest to goodness, in terms of relationships, there's not really gonna be too much not to be able to see. This is gonna be a time where honest to goodness, things are gonna be able to start coming out into the open, and you're really gonna be able to start really experiencing things in an open manner, in, in an absolutely fantastic manner, in a manner that's the best for you. This is gonna this is this is this is this is this is gonna be a time where relationships are gonna be able to see clearly, but at the same time be able to realize that there's a whole whole lot of things going on in terms of relationships, a whole lot of things going on in terms of every other situation, and just a really, really good feeling overall. It's going to make you feel fantastic, make you feel great, and make you feel like everything is honest to goodness just as it should be, okay? This is, this is definitely going to be a situation where you guys are going to be able to see the love and see the situations that are, uh, that are, that are right ahead of you. This card here is the King of Wands in reverse, saying, honest to God, this is going to be a time as well for you to be able to see all of the foundation that you guys actually really have underneath you. This is going to be a situation that is really, really going to be able to make you feel fantastic, make you feel great, because this is going to be a time where you're going to be able to finally see all the foundation that is finally underneath you. Even though you may have not have realized it for quite some time, this is going to be a time where you're really going to be able to start realizing the foundation that is really, really, really steadily holding you up. And it's really going to make you feel fantastic. Next card here is the Seven of Swords in reverse, saying that this is also going to be a situation and a time for you to be able to really experience this, this energy of really being able to go for it, go for it, go for it. You're really going to be able to have something, even though you're not really going to have to put so much effort into getting it. And that's something that's very, very important for you guys this month, because you're going to be able to have and be able to experience things, even though you're not really doing too much to be able to have or receive it. And that's a really, 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 really great thing. So honest to goodness with the Seven of Swords coming out here, look out for that wonderful energy, because it's really, really going to make you feel great. It's going to make you feel fantastic, and it's really, really going to get you feeling wonderful. Yeah, that's what I definitely get, because you're going to be able to really, really get something, and you're going to be able to get something very, very, very easily without really having to put so much effort into it. The next card here is the Page of Swords, saying, honest to goodness, this is going to be, this is going to be a time where, a Page of Swords in reverse, saying, honest to goodness, this is going to be a time where you're really going to be able to listen to the messages that come into your mind to really be able to get exactly what you want done, done. This is going to be a time where even though that you may have potentially have, have not really listened to them for quite some time, this is going to be a situation where, where they're really going to be so easy to be able to realize. You're going to be able to see exactly what you need to do to make the relationship feel amazing, or it's just going to be a situation where you're going to be able to get the understanding that you need to be able to move forward in the best way possible. This, this, is, a, this is a fantastic card to really just say, hey, you're going to be able to get what you want, you're going to be able to get what you need, and you're going to be able to move in the direction that you want to so easily this month. It's going to make you feel great, make you feel good, and just make you feel happy all at the same time. So what I'm really excited about this Page of Swords is you're just going to be able to feel really, really, really good. And I really, really like that. Next card here is the Three of Wands, saying that honest to goodness, you're really going to be able to go on a little trip, on a little journey. And this is going to be something that's really, really going to be able to move you in the right direction, move you forward, and move you in a very, very, very happy manner, in the best manner for you. It's going to make you feel good. It's going to make you feel great. And at the same time, you're going to be able to move that distance without really having to worry so much, without really having to worry so hard at all. Next card here is the Five of Cups, saying that yes, 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 you're going to be able to sort, you're going to be able to really, really hold, you're, not, you're, you're going to really need to, you're going to be able to not really have to feel like you need to hold on to anything anymore. Something is going to be given to you. You're really going to be able to move to a place that's really going to be, make you feel great and make you feel like everything is honest to goodness all right for you. You're going to be able to feel like you don't really have to hold on to anything because what, what you want to hold on is right in front of you. And honest to goodness, in terms of this situation, it's going to make you feel really, really, really really, really good, okay? 
This next card here is the Queen of Coins, saying that yes, 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 you're going to be able to feel great, but at the same time feel like there's a whole lot of passion moving forward. There's going to be a lot of feel good, a lot of great feelings. Like honest goodness with the Queen of Coins coming out here, oh my goodness, are you guys going to feel fantastic? The Queen of Coins coming out here in reverse is really just saying that you're really going to be able to see in the right direction, see in the right way, and honest to goodness, feel this situation in the right way as well. It's going to make you feel very, very good, make you feel very, very great. And with the Queen of Coins energy coming out here, it's really, really going to make you feel like everything is all right, exactly as it should be, exactly as you should be, and at the same time, exactly as everything else should be as well. It's going to just make you feel fantastic. The next card here is the Queen of Cups, saying that yes, your relationship is going to, at the end at the end of the fourth quarter here, it's going to make you feel like your emotions are really going in tandem, really moving in the right direction for you, and really just feeling very, very fantastic all at the same time. It's going to make you feel great, make you feel fantastic, and just make you feel really, really good. So honest to goodness, I really, really, really enjoyed the way that this reading went. Um, it really, really just makes me feel like everything is really, really just going in the right direction for you guys. So anyways, I'm Chris Nevada here and I also do private readings. I can do $75 for a 60 minute Skype session reading, $50 for a 30 minute Skype session reading, and a $35 for a private YouTube session. So kind of just like this, but for your specific need or issue. I'm also running a sale this month. You can contact me at chrisinvatic at yahoo.com or chrisinvatic.com. Anyways, thank you guys so, 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 so much for all your likes and your comments and your shares and subscribes. They've been absolutely amazing. And anyways, thank you guys so much, okay? And I hope you guys have an amazing October.